Hey, what's up, guys? This is an RSR2264. I just wanted to make a quick video for you guys and to tell you how to get minifig keychains off of their keychain. So, I'm going to be using this Sonic as an example. So, the first thing you're going to want to do, you're going to need some of these. And these. Alright, you want to grab that middle ring, or that uh, giant ring right before the minifig, and you're going to want to grab both ends and twist it. It's going to be a little bit hard to demonstrate uh, with one hand. And just for laughs and giggles, I decided to take apart the Mandalorian. So that's what's in uh, in the in between the legs. So it's kind of just one piece. The That piece is hollow. found kind of interesting. Because uh, Lego minifigs actually used to look like that. So, okay, and then the head... The hole all the way through, and so does the helmet. So, yeah. Interesting how keychain minifigs work. Ah, right, here we go. This is much better, so I'm gonna grab it. You want to find out where the little seam line is so you can twist it open. I think I've got it right there. Kind of hard to see on camera. And twist. Twist. Just like that. And you're pretty much halfway there. So that's just to get it off the key ring itself. And now for this part. Now this part is going to be fairly easy. If my, there would go, if my phone ever decides to focus. So you're gonna wanna pinch down on that. You wanna make sure you're kinda not gonna break the ears. Uh, wrong move. And just like that, the key ring is gone into the eighth dimension. So now you can play with your Lego minifigs pretty much like normal. Their legs don't come off, their arms do come off. Uh, well, technically the legs do kind of come off, but you gotta do that. But anyways, ultimately, I like grabbing uh, the minifig keychains because they make for cheap minifigs when you just want the minifig. So. Anyways, guys, this is Ryan Star 2264. Sound my mingles. Peace! And have a great day. And, uh, gotta go fast. Woo!